what um, is related to us is that there was some script showing at some other trial. And they had a big confrontation with a set of fighting in the school. And so, and this boy had some problem with Jamal from before with some assignment. When the whole script and fighting starts, there's a video I have here that one of the students posts and I take it out, which showing that my nephew was standing with some other friends and this boy came from behind him and lashed his head with this box. And my nephew fall on the floor, get the lock out. Regain consciousness at the Buckley's Health Center. Right there, the doctor there had already known that this child suffered serious brain injury. All of it was stitch the bus and transfer him to Georgetown Hospital, where he undergo a CT scan. With the CT scan, it proved that uh, fuel, fluid was leaking from the brain to his nose. His whole left side, there's no uh, feeling in that left side. There's no movement. He cannot grip. He cannot feel in that left side. His entire left side body, because the left eye closed down, he could only smile halfway, which is to the right alone and not to the left. He can't squeeze. He can't touch. He can't feel on the left side. Jamal is not a troublemaking child. He's not a troublemaking child. All uh, the teachers, everybody like him in the school every day. Neat and tidy, don't like to miss school, nothing at all. 